What's up, everybody? This is Chitcoin Chiller here with CryptoStarter.biz, here with a, a video on uh, how to install a Coinbase wallet. Now, uh, in a lot previous video, we showed you how to download the Exodus wallet. Here, we're going to actually do hands-on, this time with Coinbase wallet. I'm using an old phone that's never done a crypto transaction in its life here, and I, I don't think I'll do any crypto transactions on here. This is just for demonstration purposes only. And of course, this isn't my main phone, so keep that in mind then too whenever you're um, downloading a, a crypto wallet to your phone. If it's your main wallet, you get a fresh device there. Uh, and then put a completely different uh, login than uh, than you would uh, that would be identifying in any way to to any of your user IDs or email or even uh, the, any other uh, login info that you might have just for security purposes. Even better if you wanted to go to uh, 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 Kalix Solutions. Link is in the description below. There you can get your own crypto only device, crypto only laptop there. They walk you through the steps on how to set it up. But here, this uh, uh, this will show you how to download Coinbase Wallet, different from the Coinbase app uh, here on, on a phone, on an Android device in particular. So I've already got the Play Store open. I'm installing the uh, Coinbase uh, app here and while it is pending downloading and installing here. Just to kind of quick review then, uh, make sure it's actually the Coinbase wallet that you're uh, 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 that you're downloading and not a spoof. That is very important. Usually, I like to go from uh, the website there. I think if you do this from a phone, it'll try to download an extension to the browser versus the actual wallet itself. But here, it looks like we are ready to go. It's going to go through a setup process here. And... Okay, so we're going to click on create a new wallet. And then, yeah, read the terms and service, all that jazz. You really want to do this, not just scroll through, not just fly through. And then you accept. And then you pick a username. So um, that way, it, it, it's a kind of an easy way to send funds. I'm going to pick something fun here. Uh, let's do crypto starter not available what about crypto starter biz like the website suggests that works so that way um, if you wanted to have an easy way to send funds then to an ad a generic address rather than just to having a copy and paste a whole address that's an easy way to do that so maybe if you're watching randomly uh, send uh, send something over to crypto starter biz at crypto starter biz then if you feel like uh, throwing a buck or two my way. So here, uh, again, this uh, shows privacy settings. Public, that uh, having it as public will be able to uh, allow people to send funds to you then uh, with your at address there that you set up. Now, create your, protect your wallet. Uh, here, I'm gonna do this off camera just because for security purposes then Just like you never do anything with security on camera, that's just a, uh, one extra step I like to do there. Just don't show anybody your pin. Of course, I don't think we're going to see them here, but uh, you're going to have the opportunity to uh, download your 12-word 12, 12 seed phrase. And just if you're a complete noob, what that means is uh, the 12-word random phrase in order will identify your wallet so you can import that to another device then if you upgrade devices and of course you want to keep those in the same place there okay this is kind of taking its sweet time there um just yeah while we're on the topic of security then um uh, however you feel like you need to uh uh, uh keep your 12 word seed phrase secure Recommend it in a waterproof, fireproof, and then uh, um, somewhere where somebody's not gonna, like a thief is not going to come in and try and think to get like a, oh yeah like in a whatever. We're not going to go over that now, but uh, okay yeah backing up. If I hit backup now, it's going to show you that twelve word seed phrase. But I'm not going to do that here now just for security purposes, just to be ultra secure. Uh, so I'm going to do later. You're always going to have the opportunity to do that. This is just for demonstration purposes. Okay, so now 
Uh, here's where it kind of walks you through the steps on how to use a wallet then. Uh, let's see, what is this asking us to do? Sometimes I'll show you like a, a new feature or promotional feature. This might vary by the time you see this and download it. So I think we're gonna just hit maybe later now. You can connect your Coinbase account if you wanted to. I prefer not to, just so there's less of those connections out there. Um, uh, so if somebody gets into your Coinbase account or vice versa, uh, th that's just one, uh, the one extra way you can be secure. Again, the same thing. It's going to constantly remind you to back up because once you, if you lose that seed phrase, if you lose your pin, then that you say goodbye forever to those funds then. So uh, the, 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 there's no liability on Coinbase wallets part for any money that you lose. So one way they get around that is to uh, uh, remind you constantly to back up, even after you've done it. So it'll, it'll always give you that opportunity there. So here's the main wallet here. If you click on this icon to the left, that's what we're on now. You have coins, NFTs are there, but uh, uh, that's just, uh, the, we're not gonna really focus on that here in this video. Uh, but uh, here, you can send and receive. So for here, because this has nothing on it, this is just goes to show you what's what you can receive. And here, there's quite a bit. Uh, you see all these, um, the chit coins, so to speak. It's all on there. But say if you click on the Bitcoin address, then uh, it gives you the option for seg Segwit or Legacy. Of course, okay, there, if you want to if you wanna send me some uh, uh, Bitcoin there, feel free to. There's your opportunity. Of course, then you have the opportunity for username there. Again, at Crypto Starter Biz. Uh, but that, that's there. And then, of course, the same thing is going to be for ETH or, uh, say, if you wanted to do SHIB. SHIB's there. Again, same deal. It's there for you. And again, like I said, I'm not really going to use this wallet for anything just as an FYI. I'll probably uninstall it here, maybe. Uh, and then also you have the opportunity to uh, swap with other coins that are available on Coinbase Wallet. And then this gives you the opportunity to swap between. Again, there's nothing on here. Uh, maybe in another video I'll show you how to do that, but it's really simple. So here, if you had like 100 bucks of BTC on there, you can convert BTC to choose your own, whatever you wanted to. I don't know how these are listed. Uh, it doesn't look like, uh, I think this is kind of like the top ranking by market cap, perhaps. Uh, but uh, the, the yeah. And then once you do, you put in the amount and then it'll ask you to confirm maybe by entering your pin again. Uh, okay, so one other neat thing then too is it's got its own decentralized browser that's already connected to the wallet. So if you wanted to swap for a coin that's not available on Coinbase, but on say Pancake Swap. Pancake swap, fat fingering this here. Dot finance. Hard to do when you're not really looking at it when you're showing the camera there. So yeah, it's got its own decentralized browser in there that's already kind of connected to. Okay, so this is this with Pancake Swap, you can uh, uh, choose which chain you're uh, trading on. But yeah, here. This is where you connect to a wallet. And then uh, I, I think we're already connected here. Uh, again, so if you wanted to trade either um, uh, swap anything that's on Ethereum or Binance, you have that option to here. Uh, but that's a topic for another video then. Uh, maybe you already have used uh, Pancake Swap with another format by either like capturing it, screen capturing it on a computer with uh, your crypto only phone there. But uh, yeah, that's basically it. Uh, that kind of gives you all you need to know to at least set it up. Um, now, if you are a complete noob, feel free to go over to Crypto Started Up Biz. You can schedule a one-on-one -on -one Zoom call with me and I can walk you through the steps uh, on how to do that. Uh, if you wanted to mint an NFT or if you just wanted to pick my brain for a half hour or an hour, then that option's there. Uh, but uh, other than that, uh, uh, yep, this gives you an idea what to, what to expect. 
uh, uh, thanks. Be sure to like and subscribe. And then if you have any comments, uh, if you think there's anything I missed or any wallets you want to see uh, demonstrated here uh, or any features or just a question in general, maybe it can be asked, uh, uh, answered in a comment. Uh, uh, feel free then to drop a comment below, but be, be sure to like and subscribe and head over to CryptoStarter.biz then uh, just to check out uh, what we have to offer. Thanks.